Hey guys, in today's video I will show you how you can adjust any picture in Affinity Designer to any form you want to. So first of all you just need to simply insert your picture into Affinity Designer. After that I will simply plan this out so we don't get distracted from this. After that you just need to create the forms you want to use, you want to adjust your image to or put your image into and then I am selecting the rectangle for example holding down shift and um, holding down the, um, um, the uh, mouse and then um, s making a perfect square right here holding down shift just um, um, gives you perfect uh, proportions so in this case um, a, a square out of the rectangle and I'm doing the same with a circle for example and also with a triangle you can choose the triangle if it's not visible right here by this little um, corner right here clicking on the corner and then you can choose triangle tool and then the same holding down shift and creating the triangle for example uh, of course you can um, just change the form as you want you can also um, change the corners you can change the um, the settings for each um, form and so on. So now what you have to do is you need to um, in this case duplicate the image because you want to insert and adjust to three forms and I'm clicking on command and C for copying and command and V for pasting in three two times so I have three images. If you're using a Windows PC you need to use control instead of command so control C copy control V paste and then just move the image underneath the layer, underneath the form you want to put it in and move it one to the right by um, still holding down and then uh, let it go. And then you have to move it underneath the triangle and then everything um, of the image uh, is invisible instead of the form. So you can adjust how it looks by just adjusting the image, but you will only see what's underneath exactly underneath the form you could also rotate it for example and so on and we could also now click on the rectangle triangle right here and choose the corner tool right here for first of all we of course need to look convert to curves and we could also now um, right here is the corner tool sorry so just select the corners for example give a radius of 10 pixels and then the corners are more smooth and we have to do the same with the rectangle so for this we need to um, keep in mind that we can only select the layer underneath if we're not already the layer underneath. So I'm, I'm moving this down to move it up again underneath to the right and let it go. And then selecting the normal um, um, move tool right here, clicking on this image and moving underneath the rectangle to adjust it to this rectangle. And also the same for the circle moving underneath to the right and letting go and then moving to the circle right here. And then we can always um, um, adjust our image, our form, how, what of our image is visible through the form by clicking on this little arrow, clicking on the image and then moving the image and making it bigger, scaling it, rotating it and so on. And as said before, you can, you can insert adjust any picture in Affinity Designer to any form you can create. So also forms you can create with uh, the pen tool right here. And you can adjust the forms as much as you want. So for example, we could also um, convert to curves, um, curves the um, um, square and also give it there a little of corner, for example, 10 pixels to also smooth our corners right here. And then we could move our rectangle in the middle, our triangle in the middle and our square in the, uh, circle in the middle to view all of our um, creations right here. And that's gonna do for today's video. If you enjoyed watching, don't forget to like and subscribe and hopefully see you in the next video and bye.